Hey everyone, Tom Geraldson here. Gonna do the August MTB Slam. Let's go through these baits real quick. You can see I already opened the box. Hard. As always, they put the Dibble Digest in there. Pretty cool little magazine. Give you some tips and tricks. Alright, first bait we got is the BD BDO W12 or half inch spinner bait. Goes from Castaic, goes for $7.99. Pretty good looking spinner bait. Next up is the Akari Shad. Um, lipless, kind of shallow running crankbait. It sinks as well. Kind of cool, it has like some gill plates on it. I'll show that to you more when I rig it up. Next up from Castaic again is the three pack of Super Jerk J. Oh, Super Jerky J. They go for $3.50. Oh, this uh, Ikari sells for, or retails for $5.99. This retails for $3.50 a pack. Something they started doing, a normal pack, six pack is $6.99. So at least they give you the amount or the cost of a, one of their sample packs. Next up is a Pop Shads, five inch from Z-Man. Sells for $2.00. Uh, normal three pack sells for $5.99. Last of the lures is a six inch lizard from Bonehead Tackle. A four pack sells for $1.77. Normal nine pack is $3.99. And this one is in Green Pumpkin Flash. Um, we got some from Daiachi. Some 5 Ot Fat Gap Worm Tube Hooks. Probably rig that up with the uh, with the lizards there and some dude wipes. Can never go wrong with some dude wipes. And then it's their third anniversary, I guess, this year, which is pretty cool. They always give us something, which is pretty neat. And we got another who rag this year. So we'll throw that on when the sun starts coming out. Kind of protect myself a little bit. And we got some. Coupon from Dude White Productions, the backside coupon that they give you for someone else if they want to try the box. Get the first one for $4.99. I'm sorry, $4.99. Mystery Tackle Box sticker and the scratch off. Now, let's see if we can win anything on the scratch off, shall we? Match three. Nope, not this time. And I would have won a VRX fishing rod and reel glove, but oh well, maybe next month. All right, let's get to it, shall we? Okay, just so everyone knows, I did dip the uh, lizard in some JJ's Magic, dip the tail in it. This water's kind of dark, and this dark colored worm, I wanted to give it some kind of flash. Okay, here's those gill plates I was talking about on this Matsuo lure. Kind of cool. Maybe add some vibration in the water. You know, we'll see if it works. Okay, I rigged up this Castaic soft bait, the uh, Super Jerky J. Got it on a New Tech lure, uh, a little 3 8 ounce, kind of a swim jig. Um, got some nice action on it. Real loose fit. See how it does. Okay, so I changed it up a little bit. I got this Ned rig um, hook in a previous episode or a previous month. So I just stuck it on there. Maybe it'll look like little bait fish, little baby bass picking at stuff on the bottom. See how this works.
first off. He almost got away. Oh, he does. He's leaning his upper lip. Caught him on the lizard. Find me. Nice looking fish right there. Alright, caught my first one. He almost got away. And that hook just went into his upper lip. Caught him on the lizard, finally. Nice looking fish right there. I haven't caught a fish since that one I caught earlier, tripping fishing. Yeah, I saw one. Went up, came up on this. Oh, there's one. Oh, that's why I called you. Right there. <laughs> that's exactly why I called you. Get some of your freaking mojo. It's two. Okay, so let's wrap this. Um, I caught two fish today. Both of them on the bonehead tackle six inch lizard green pumpkin flash um, I did dip them dip the tails in JJ's magic I don't know if it helped or not but and I had those both Adam rig I had those rigged on the uh, Daiichi D39Z fat gap worm tube hook. Um, the hooks are alright. They, uh, they caught two fish, so that was good, but they are not the sharpest hooks I've ever used. Um, didn't catch anything on this Castaic Super Jerky. Um, I didn't really know how to fish. I guess it's like a jerk bait, but oh well. Um, nor did I catch anything on the Z Man 10X Tough pop shads. I really didn't care for it. It's kind of big and bulky and for this lake it's probably too much. Um, the, the two lures I really did like, I didn't catch anything on, were the, uh, Akari, the Matsuo Akari shad. That's a pretty cool little lipless crankbait. Um, I wish I could have caught something. And then the uh, from Castaic, the BDOW half, half ounce spinner bait. That's a pretty cool spinner bait. I'll probably use that a lot. No, I don't know if you can hear it, but it's starting to thunder, so it's time for me to get out of Dodge. And that's the end of this one. Hopefully we'll do better next month.